What's up, y'all? I'm actually here today to talk about New York sports. Uh, as you guys may know, I'm a big Yankee fan, as you can see my hat. Um, yeah, but ever since the second half, they've been, you know, kind of struggling. Even though yesterday they beat my, um, the Red Sox, I believe, 5-3. Um, yeah, so it was actually a good win for them, but it hasn't been the same hot streak that they had when they initially first started um, the season, so to speak. So, yeah, I'm kind of worried about all my New York sports team right now. My Knicks are one. The Jets, let's not even talk about it. I'm also a Jets fan. I'm a Knicks fan. So, yeah, misery is part of every season. It's kind of, you know, <laughs> a bad thing for me. It's really, really bad right now, except that you know, the pandemic year where the Knicks made the playoff and got wiped out by the guy swept by the Atlanta Hawks. Um, yeah, but um, yeah, so as far as right now, the Knicks missed out on Donovan Mitchell, which would have been a great player for us to add, but we would have to give up so much um, other players, so much good players just to get him. So probably it would be the same Carmelo Anthony situation where we don't have nobody around him, even though he's a superstar, all-star, or a star, so to speak. So that's the problem with the Knicks. As far as the Jets is concerned, that's a whole nother dilemma. Oh, man, I've been waiting since the Parcel era for a winning team, and I haven't had one, to be honest with you. Je Rex Ryan did a couple good years um uh, had a couple good years of uh you know good teams here and there when we went to the afc um championship twice with mark sanchez of course and obviously that quickly fizzled out so yeah i'm just trying to see if um you guys can comment below and any new york fans um you know let me know what's going on. Like, just give me a thought process. And also, don't forget to subscribe as well. Yeah, but as of right now, uh, I'm not really optimistic on any team winning the championship. Any championship in New York anytime soon. So that kind of hurts me. I'm a, like I said before, I'm a Yankee fan. I'm a Jets fan. I'm a Knicks fan. Not a Brooklyn Nets fan because obviously they just moved to Brooklyn not too long ago. So they were in New Jersey before. So yeah. And also I'm a Rangers fan as well. Um, yeah, so that practically is my uh, misery, so to speak. So I'm trying to see exactly what you guys expect in the NBA season coming up and what you guys expect for the Jets to do. Because right now, our quarterback is down for another three or more weeks, and we only got Joe Flacco uh, running the show, and we already see how that's going as far as the Jets is concerned. He's old. He's not mobile, so he has to be at the same spot all the time pretty much, and our line is not doing a good job protecting him, so the offense is behind, and, yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> As far as the Jets is concerned, it's going to be a bad four weeks. I'm hoping they win against the Cleveland round this week, but I'm not I'm not a betting man, so I'm not going to put my money on that. If I was a betting man, I wouldn't put many money on that either. Uh, as far as the Knicks is concerned, I don't know, man. I don't know. It's a tough one because Julius Randle and J R.J. Barrett, all these guys are cool and all, but uh, yeah, it's very hard to put my finger on it right now and figure out what kind of season they will have in the future or even this season. So I don't know what's going to happen. Plus, we gave Randall a huge extension and he hasn't played quite as good. He didn't play good last year. He had a down year. RJ Barrett is progressing, but that's about all that we can talk about. Hopefully, our free agent... Um, from Dallas can bring us some excitement from there. But uh, yeah, I just need to know what you guys think and just feel free to comment, like, and don't forget to subscribe as well because I'm going to be doing these videos specifically about the Jets 
on a week to week now that football season's um on its way. Today's Thursday night football. I'm looking forward to watching that. But uh yeah, Sunday is gonna be brutal again to watch my Jets uh practically suffer a loss. Uh yeah. We're nowhere near where we need to be coaching GM wise and everything. So kinda hurts my soul. All right, guys, have a good one. I hope to hear from you guys in the comments and feel free to like also. And don't forget to subscribe as well. Have a good one. All right, thanks. Bye. Peace.